Yeah. Then, of course, we have the choice between conventional and dry sanitation. And uh, I don't want to go into this too much because we deal this with, in, uh, um, with this topic in a uh, different lecture. And uh, just uh, one word about the uh, charpeta sanitation concept. Uh, for a lot of eco houses, people build their own dry toilets. What is okay if you are in a rural setting, there is enough space and people are capable and willing of operating them. For most of the world population, this is not an option. So whenever you plan for ecological sanitation, you should consider a system that is operated professionally. So my suggestion is to have these uh, container toilets that are operated with very, very little water and uh, that would be uh, emptied just like solid waste uh, disposal collection and brought to a uh, treatment site or being worked into the ground as a humus building material but very few people do have space enough to really deal with their excreta on their own land and um, it's better to have this in a well in, in professional hands than people emptying their excreta bins to the side of the ground what what is not really a, a good idea <coughs> 